Hey, should be good to go. Core enhancements disabled. Alright, so stopping everyone, it's the three side, entertainment one. Right. Um just here to give an uh my updated thoughts on on the World Cup, if you will, uh, the ICC Cricket World Cup, uh, as uh, seeing as though the first day of warm up of, of warm up matches has you know has been com completed. Well, it was the first warm up match I think it was India versus Australia in Adelaide, where Australia ended up crushing India like a bug. Um, Australia made some about three seventy one without their fifty overs being batted out. Okay, so India in initially got off to a flying start, but then you knew that Australia had the better bowlers. You knew that. And um, so India, in the end, I believe were all off for 230 or 40 odd. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, didn't, I, didn't watch the, I didn't watch the second innings. Um, but anyway, it's a warm up game, and what to expect? Um, if all the pitches are like this or, or somewhat similar, expect something very, you know, some very one-sided games. As in, like, bat, when it comes to bat versus ball, expect very batting game, you know, a batting friendly games. Like, don't expect the, you know, like overwhelming achievement of bowlers if this is the if this is the norm, and if the bowlers have to succeed, uh, you can. Pretty much expect most of the bowl bowlers are going to be fast bowlers who actually uh, shine through in, in, in this tournament. Uh, because the spinners, um, I don't know, I don't know. The DC more like a uh, fast bowling pitches to me. Um, now I know there was some issue. I know like you know the the actual pitch positioning was a bit skewed towards one side that left one boundary way bigger than the, than, uh, than the other boundary in Adelaide. I know that, but. I, uh, you can presume that the the pitch might be a bit more centered. Uh, the pitch might be a bit more uh, a centered, you know, once the tournament starts proper. So once that happens, um, uh, you know, it'll be a much more interesting contest to see. And given you know how David Warner is in form, Shane Watson is in form, Glenn Maxwell, George Bailey are returning into form apparently. And Mitchell Johnson can also hit the ball, and we all know what a we all know what a what a beast he is. You know, Mitchell Johnson is returned from with the bat. He, you know, he can hit the bat. Also, he can hit the ball. Uh, you know, a long way with the bat, and we know what a beast, what a what a demon he is with the ball. So, so yeah, um, um, expect a very strong Australia this time around. Now. Personally, from my perspective, Bangladesh have their fucking work cut out for them. Oh my God, they have the work cut out for them because they they are the team who want to aim for 250, 260. These pitches are not 250, 260 is something that will get chased down less than 40 overs. So Bangladesh have the work really cut out for them. Everyone has to give in on 120 percent, and this is where it kind of bothers me that you know they actually dropped up the, up the Razak. Abdul Razak, who's actually kind of tearing it down right now in in uh, NCL. In fact, this happens to Razak. Once he's dropped from a selection, he will go in the NCL and take seven wickets, eight wickets, ten wickets, eleven wickets, and that's what he did. I believe once he got not once he didn't get selected, he took he took eleven wickets in that match, and and you could pretty much say he he and uh, a, a a couple of domestic uh, uh, double centuries. I believe one of them was from. I forgot. I forgot who he, I forgot who it was, but I, but yeah, uh, it, it was one of the uh, top order batsmen. Might have been Ronit Ronit Uh but might have been someone else as well. But still, uh, dropping someone experienced like Abdul Razak might actually come to haunt them back. And also, given the fact that these most of the players have never played an international, uh, you know. Series in Australia at this level, I believe Mortada was I, I think the only one who actually did who, when they toured Australia. I think da, back in two thousand and three, there's an innings by Hanan Sharkar made eighty two or something. But yeah, um, apart f now, let's talk about the other news. Um, um, 
you could kind of expect Shoy Gadi will not turn up in this in this tournament. But Saeed Ajmal, he's clear to bowl now. And he says he has added a few more deliveries in, in, in his repertoire. Here's what I don't like. Don't tell people what those deliveries are. You want to keep it a mystery, then keep it a mystery. Don't tell people what they are. But anyways, um, if someone gets injured, uh, Saeed Ajmal said he's slated to come in. So, let's see. Let's see. You know how things work with, with these things. You know, they can always report an injury. Um, apart from that, um, uh, one thing uh, I actually wanted to br uh, bring up as well. Um, Australia, especially at home, are getting back that venom. And this is a very lethal venom. Because think about it. Last Ashes, when it happened in Australia... The pussies, the pussies stood out from the men. The pussies stood out from the men. Okay. Grand Swan, pussy number one, Grand Swan. He showed up, he showed up on the third test, a uh, third or fourth test. He showed up in the next, like, guys, I'm retiring. Bye. Yeah. And if there's something I cannot respect, I don't give a fuck who they are. If there's something I cannot respect is a quitter. Especially in the middle of a tournament. In the middle of a tournament, a quitter. I cannot respect that. So, from now till the end of time, I will not respect Grand Swan as, as a cricketer. Because he quit. In the middle of a tournament, he quit. He quit. And a lot of respect for, like, from my perspective, a lot of respect for Jonathan Trott has also gone down. Has also gone down. Because I don't respect that motherfucker anymore. You know, as, as I used to either. And I used to respect the hell out of, out of Jonathan Trump. I'm like, this, this motherfucker, man. Like, you know, if he, if he sets in, if he sets in, he can be, he can be the, like, you know, the immovable object of English cricket in test cricket. One bat, one, one horrendous series. No, no, wait, wait. Before the horrendous series. He pulled out in the first test. Jonathan Trump pulled out in the first test. Once we found... Once he found out that is he gonna pull, like you know was he gonna pull a, a Marcus Truscothic like you know was it that bad? He said no, I'm just burned out. I just, uh, just like you know, I just didn't feel like like shut the fuck up. This is your job, okay? You get burned out, learn how to love it. This is your fucking job, okay? And no, I never, I never, never shut the fuck up. No, no, that's. That's what separates hard workers from lazy workers, okay? If you say, oh, no, I don't have, I, uh, oh, no, I'm, I'm, I'm totally free to love what I want to do. Shut the fuck up. They, all those have consequences. Do you understand that? If had these happened at the end of the series, I would have totally understood it. I would have totally, you know, supported it. I'm like, okay, Grand Thorn had his time. Jonathan Trott, you know, he's burned out. He needs uh, a few series off. You know, the, he needs a few, he needs a, a, a few matches, like, you know, a, a, a few a tours off. I could have understood that. But after the first day, this, oh, no, I'm, oh, no, I, I just missed home. I just missed, I, you know, I just missed, I just missed, like, you know, like, like, you know, the, the, the English uh, blindness of, and, and all that shit. So, those two pussies got called, you know, got caught. Alistair Cook, Alistair Cook came out, you know, uh, Alistair Cook came out of his, uh, 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 testosterone uh, uh, pills, and then we found out he's also a giant p pussy because he blamed everything on Ke Kevin Peterson. When Kevin Peterson actually was one of the best, most prolific scorers in that tournament. Okay, now moving on to Australia versus India. What happened? Dhoni retired from from Test cricket after the series. Dhoni retired from Test cricket. Believe me, this puts some confidence in Australia that you know. They have this contagious, they have this effect of humiliating teams so badly that, you know, like, you know, their captains and their key players feel humili humiliated and overpowered and defeated. When a team is, is buzzing with this confidence, it's, you know, it's very hard to stop. And this is kind of reminiscent of what happened in, in 2007 when... Uh, to the, you know, 2007, like, you know, that, that, that invincible team and... 2008 holy crap how don't these people see that it was Tendulkar who won them the CB series 
otherwise you know the, the as an average like you know leave Tendulkar aside as an average the Indian players are way below the Australian players at that time right and I believe Australia did, uh, didn't have a uh, uh, Glenn McGraw or, or Shane Warne but when when a team is bothered with this confidence you know this is the team to watch out for now in Bangladesh's group uh, they have some smaller teams but then again you know they have lost their opening two uh, warm-up matches against an Australia uh, Australia eleven, so that's not a good that's not a good sign to start off with. Believe me, if this if this team fails, a big shit storm is coming the BCB's way. And speaking of the BCB, um, I'd rather not talk about my my true feelings about the politics that's you know like the, the political uh, situation that's going on I'd rather not talk about it um, but yeah a real shit storm is, is coming the BCB's uh, uh, will, will be coming the, the, the BCB's way and then it'll be kind of fun to see you know like how, how many excuses and how many coaches they sack because that that seems to be that seems to be you know their protocol alright so th that was just that was just a quick update and you know just to you know just to give you my thoughts on what to expect from the uh, Cricket World Cup. Right? Looking forward to your constant suggestions. This is the Rear Side of the Tan Man, signing out.